Hello everybody. Welcome to the second council meeting for this box of Jumpstart. We have our next eight packs here. And we're just going to get cracking. We're going to open these up for you guys. Nice and quick to get her done. First one is spell casting. I'm once again going to open up all eight first and then we'll go pick which ones we want. Ooh, elves. I'm going to be opening that one last because I hope there's a I hope there's a nice crater hook in that. I'll use it for one of my EDH decks. What else we got? Reanimated. Nice. I'm also on the lookout for uh, any misprinted jumpstart cards that I may have. May pull in these. There's been a lot of them apparently. Now they're above the clouds. We had one of those in our first video. Feathered friends. So we got our flying friends here. Witchcraft. So if I remember right, in Elves, Creator of has a 1 in 3 or 1 in 4 chance, I can't remember. Angels. And Well Read. I've never opened one of those yet. So we're going to start off with uh, Reanimated. If I could find the little tabby thing. There we go. And in Reanimated, ours is Rise of the Dark Realms. Starting off with a Mythic. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Is that on screen? There we go. Carrying Grub. Gorma. Actually not a bad card in, in the actual gameplay. Not much. Not sure how much I'd actually play it in, in, in a... Somewhat of a... More... Constructed series, I guess. We're going to actually open that well-read one of the last ones because I've never opened it yet, so I can't remember what's in it. When I was playing Jumpstart on Arena, I was actually checking out all the decks before I was choosing them and deciding what I wanted to play. Linvala. Look at that. Another Mythic. That brings us up to three Mythics in our box right now. Counting the other ones from uh, our first video. Make sure you go check that out. Let's open up the witchcraft one now. More garbage. Bog Brew Witch. And a Witch of the Moors. 4-4 Four -four Death Touch. Actually a really, really good card when I've been seeing it played in Arena. Really hard to deal with. Um, what else we got in here? Calder Familiar, of course. Of course we got Calder Familiar. Because why would they not want to annoy me with Cauldron Familiar? Hopefully you guys have been liking Jumpstart so far. When you guys have either played on Arena or in Paper. If you got the chance to play with your friends. Marshall. Healer's Hawk. Always great. Let's do Above the Clouds. Let's go straight to another Flyers, another flyers pack. Another Inyad, so that's our second one. Tide Skimmer, always good. Oh, I didn't know Lofty Denial was in this. That's awesome. Uh, we're going to do spell casting now. And we got Immol Imm Immolating Gyre. I could say that. It's three mythics in this series of eight. It's pretty good. I'm not a fan of them going back to this shock art. I wish they would have gone for like one of the older ones, but can't do much about that. Oh, hey, let's do this well read here. I can't remember what's in this one. I'm guessing it's Merfolk from the from the art on the on the front. Mystic Alchemist. And a reader of runes. Okay. Oh, this appears to be card draw by the looks of it. Yeah, this is card draw. Ruin Servitor. Great, pretty decent card. Now, are we going to get that Crater Hoof? All oh, these are off screen. Are we going to get this Crater Hoof in this Elves pack? I think it's like a 1 in 3 or 1 in 4 chance or something like that. I can't remember how many Elf decks are there. And we got a Loris Shepherd. Not our Crater Hoof that we were looking for, but that's still 4 Mythics out of these 8. So that's 50% Mythic rate. I can't complain about that. We're going to keep pull up this Llanowar Visionary because it's incredibly good. 
And that's it. So yeah, we have four mythics. Rise of the Dark Realms, Linvala, Immolating Gyre, and an Allura Shepherd in this in these set of eight. In this other one third of a box of mine. Brings our total up to five mythics for the box so far. And uh, thanks everybody for watching. Thanks uh, to our sponsor Geekified. Make sure you go check him out for all your MTG and non-MTG related needs. Have a great day.